morning and welcome to the 2023 Korea Drone Show. We are here in beautiful Busan, South Korea at Bexco. This is the biggest drone show in this part of the world, especially in Korea. It is filled with all sorts of exhibitors, buyers, different conferences, events that you can attend, all sorts of stuff as well that you can try, kind of different exhibits and um, things you can experiment with. It's taking place over the next three days here in Busan. Today is the first day, Thursday. We've just had the opening ceremony. It will also take place over Friday and Saturday. You're welcome, of course, to join us. So let's get started here at Bexco. All right, so here at Bexco Drone Show 2023, I want to take you into this company here, which is Rovos Tech, and have a look at some of the interesting stuff they're doing. Hello, 안녕하세요. 안녕하세요. 네, 그 회사 소개 좀 부탁드립니다. 예, 저희는 부산 기장에 있는 수중 드론 개발 업체 Rovos Tech이라고 합니다. So this company is based here in Busan, actually, and they do underwater training and education for how to use these roving drones. Okay. 네. 예, 저희는 현재 그 수중 어, 정찰 및 탐색용 수중 드론 제품하고 그다음에 이쪽에 있는 그 터널 관로 조사용 수중 드론 제품을 어, 소개해 드리려고 나왔습니다. Oh wow. So as you can see these are all designed to be used underwater and this one in a tunnel as well. Okay. 어떤 특징이 있나요? 아, 지금 이쪽에 있는 두 개의 제품은 기본적으로 카메라하고 소나 제품 아, 소나 그 장치들이 있어 가지고 수중에서 이제 관찰이나 조사용으로 활용이 되고요. 그래서 그리고 이제 이쪽에 있는 제품은 관로나 터널 내부에 들어가서 어, 터널이나 관로 상태를 점검하는 용도로 활용이 되겠습니다. So these have different specifications that I'll tell you about. This one is designed to be used in kind of like smaller spaces, like a tunnel. As you can see, it's more direct and long there. These are um, designed with cameras, which we can see, and also with sonar. So on the video, if you come and watch it more up close, it can give you all sorts of reporting of what's underneath. So the Robo Ocean and the Robo 3. Okay. Is there anything else you'd like to tell us? 아 현재 이 제품들은 사양은 최대 한 150m까지 잠수가 가능하고요. 예. 그리고 이 터널 터널용 제품들은 광케이블을 사용해서 거리상으로도 한 1km까지 조사가 가능하겠습니다. It can go up to 1,500 uh, meters below water, which is actually really far. It can take up to 20 kilos of weight, so that's quite a lot. So you can see here the different specifications. As we said, 1,500 meters below water. That's awesome. That's quite deep. Um, 그래서 오늘 뭐 드론 쇼 참가하는 이유 무엇인가요? 예, 현재 지금 저희가 구, 그 해경이라든가 해군 방산 쪽으로 소개를 드리려고 나왔고요. 그리고 저희가 이제 수출용으로 인도네시아하고 파키스탄에도 지금 대리점을 이제 올해부터 개소해서 어, 홍보하려고 나왔습니다. So they wanted to attend because they've been doing a lot of work with the Navy and so they want to maintain that relationship. Also, they have um, set up distributors in Indonesia and Pakistan. So they want to, of course, show other customers who would be interested in similar things some of the items there. I see. So, 향후 개발 계획 가능한 향후 뭐 어떻게 돼요? 아, 예, 저희가 좀 예, 이런 일반적인 수중 드론 제품 외에도 양식장을 관리하거나 클리닝하는 수중 로봇하고 선저 청소 수중 로봇을 현재 개발하고 있고요. 앞으로 이제 민간 조선소나 어, 해운사 쪽에 그 클리닝 용도로 납품을 하려고 준비를 하고 있습니다. So they've got lots of plans for the future. Obviously, these drones are ready to use, as we can see here. But their plans for the future would include cleaning drones, drones. Oh, there's another drone. Drones that would, um, if you see this video, it shows that it can get quite up close and quite in small areas. So if they could then show that in kind of a, um, with a cleaning um, possibility and capabilities, then that would be great. So 150 meters again below water. That's incredible. Um, oh, target market is how do you do? 네, 현재 저희가 한국전력공사나 수자원공사 같이 민간 이제 기관이나 업체들 하고요. 그 다음에 이제 향후에는 저희가 해군이나 해경, 광선, 관공서나 방산 쪽으로도 진출을 하려고 준비하고 있습니다. So as mentioned, yeah, they do a lot of work with the Navy, with companies that are doing this, as we said, underwater stuff. But of course, expanding internationally with other companies who are doing similar would be their plans for the future. Okay, well, thank you so much for showing us there, Robos Tech. Thank you very much. That's great. 감사합니다. Yeah, bye-bye. Thanks. Yeah, we got to see here Robos Tech here in Busan at Bexco at Drone Show 2023.